Apple's M1 chipset upgrade for the latest iPad Pro brought some significant changes in terms of performance and productivity. Similarly, the new Surface Pro 9 from Microsoft also got great performance boosts and visual upgrades. But how powerful is this new Surface Pro 9 compared to the M1 iPad Pro? In today's video, we will be comparing the new Surface Pro 9 with the M1 iPad Pro and find out which one is the best. Unlike the previous Pro 8 version, the Surface Pro 9 comes with some really great color choices such as Platinum, Graphite, Sapphire and Forest. You can also choose the same colors for your new Surface Pro keyboard as well, which are definitely visually pleasing to look at. Other than that, you won't notice any other significant changes on this new Surface Pro 9. On top of that, the Surface Pro keyboard has a dedicated room for the Surface Slim Pen 2, which charges automatically while it's in idle mode. Also, thanks to its flexible kickstand on the back, you can almost bend it all the way down to the surface, almost close to 180 degrees. On the other hand, the M1 iPad Pro also followed the design of the standard iPad Pro version which is available in two different colors, silver and space gray version. And yes, this device is a lot thinner when compared to the Surface Pro 9. It's only 5.9mm thin and surprisingly very lightweight as well. And it's also compatible with other Apple accessories such as Magic Keyboard and Apple Pencil too. And this pencil can be magnetically attached to the side panel for easy storage and charging. So design-wise, both these devices resemble themselves with their own aesthetics and styles. While the Surface Pro 9 has some really great color choices, the M1 iPad Pro comes in a much thinner and more compact size. In this case, you can say it's pretty from both sides. As we move on to the specs, it's clearly noticeable that the new Surface Pro 9 has got a handful of performance upgrades other than its visual enhancement. Among some of the noticeable internal hardware changes, the 12th Gen i5 Intel processor upgrade and up to 32GB of LPDDR5 RAM changes are worth pointing out. Also, the integrated Iris XE graphics is still pretty strong enough to handle most graphically intensive works. Additionally, this device is also equipped with an AI-enhanced automatic framing at the front and a 4K video rear camera which produces stunning images and incredibly well video quality. As for the connectivity, it has two Thunderbolt 4 ports and it also supports Wi-Fi 6 including Bluetooth 5.1 connections as well. Similarly, apart from the M1 chip, the M1 iPad Pro also went through some major changes as well, such as a next-gen neural engine, up to 16GB of RAM, 2TB of internal storage support and a Thunderbolt 4 port for super-fast data transmission. The 12MP true depth camera also got some impressive buffs as well, such as ultra-wide angle, 2 times optical zoom and center stage, which automatically tracks your face and puts you in the middle of the screen. Besides their powerful internal hardware upgrades, both these devices have excellent displays. Microsoft Surface Pro 9 comes with a 13-inch Pixel Sense Edge 2 Edge display with 2880 by 1920 resolution and a 120Hz refresh rate. On top of that, this screen also supports Dolby Vision IQ and has built-in auto color gamut management delivering crisp colors and top-notch image quality. In comparison, the M1 iPad Pro has a 12.9-inch Liquid Retina exterior display with 2732 by 2048 resolution and 1600 nits peak brightness. Whether you watch high-quality content or work on heavy color-intensive projects, you're less likely to get tired of staring at this screen. Just like the design, the internal hardware and specs from both these devices are really different. While the Surface Pro 9 got 12-gen Intel processor upgrades delivering significantly better performance, the M1 chip on the iPad Pro made a huge impact on productivity boosts in this device. And the same goes for the display as well. If you want a big screen with a high refresh rate, then Surface Pro 9 is a great choice. And if you want a really bright display with super high resolution, then the M1 iPad Pro is perfect for you. Although there are a ton of differences between these devices, in the end, both will deliver you some solid performance in terms of productivity and multitasking, especially in the creative fields. So which one do you like the most? And can the Surface Pro 9 take over the M1 iPad Pro? Let us know your opinions in the comment section down below. So that was all about today's comparison video between the new Surface Pro 9 versus M1 iPad Pro. Thanks for watching. If you found this video to be helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this.